Hey guys, uh, I just thought I'd uh, do a quick review. I've had the Phasercom, my uh, discovery phaser. Um, if you can see, it's really, really impressed. Um, it was off eBay. I can give you the link if anyone wants it. It's really solid. Um, it's quite, quite, quite whitey as well. Um, it's been, it's painted really well. Um, and there's a couple of little bits that I can probably just touch up. Uh, where the paint's just sort of gone over the black a little bit, but uh, other than that, it's really I'm re I'm, I'm really impressed. I think it was uh, I think with with postage it was about thirty five pound, um, and I, I didn't expect it to look as good as the as the photos on eBay. I thought it might not be quite as quite as well painted as the photos, but I've got to say it's exactly the same as the photos. Um, it's painted well. It's really solid. Um, it comes with two. If I can put that there without knocking it over, which I, which I did earlier, um, comes with two different button settings. You've got the stun and the obviously the kill, and they just pop in there. Um, if I can pop one in without it falling over, there you go. May need to have a. May need to put either a magnet or maybe a bit of Velcro in there because. If it's in a holster, it will it will fall out, um, and unfortunately, the the type one phaser doesn't come off. I know I know a few people make them where the, the type one phaser comes off, but to be honest, I mean I've got the original series phaser, and I never take the the type one phaser off, um, so it's fine really. I mean obviously it doesn't make any sounds, but it's um, I mean the 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 lighting is not great. I'm doing it here in my kitchen. Um, but it's painted really well. I'm really impressed. I was shocked um, when it came this morning how, how actual nice it is. Um, I mean, I've, I've, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing it's 3D printed. I don't know because it's really, it's quite, quite heavy. Um, and I've, I've, I've held some of the, some people's um, phaser rifles and they're, that have been 3D printed and they seem to be really light. But this seems to be heavier than some of the phaser phaser rifles that I've uh, that I've looked at. Um, but I've got a I've got a an actual um, holster that I bought off eBay for about about eight pound, and it fits in there just nicely. Um, if I'm quick, I'll show you the box that it came in. Um, I'll just put the phaser over here for a sec. Um, it, it came in a re really well packaged actually. Um, as you can see, um, came packaged really well. Um, it didn't take long to come from China either. I was surprised. I think I ordered it. Um, I ordered it like a week, week and a half ago, and it's already here. Um, I am gonna. I, I ordered one because my my wife is actually. I'm gonna get one for my wife because my wife's got a, a discovery. Uh, well, a, an actual enterprise costume. Um, and I, was, I thought I'd wait to see this one first, see what it's like before before I order another one. And I'm definitely going to order another one. So thumbs up, definitely rec recommend it. Um, so if anyone wants the link to the guy on eBay, I will put it in the comments below. Um, and that's about it, guys. Have a nice day. And that's, this is uh, Dale Smith, admin of the Unity Station, signing off.